The Coast Redwoods of California The Coast Redwoods of California belong to the Suppressaceae family and the Sequoiaceae subfamily. The genus therein is called Sequoia sempervirens, which is also the reason redwoods are commonly called sequoias. The term sequoia is actually more correct when it comes to describing these trees, but redwoods is also acceptable. We all know redwoods, or sequoias, for being very, very tall and very, very thick. But exactly why? The answer lies in pieces, or rather, in many answers. First of all, they live in such an area that in the summer, evapotranspiration cannot happen because there is too much fog. Also, it has no natural enemies, except termites, and it has even found ways to get rid of termites. It has a poison called tannin in its bark, and if a bug eats the bark, it will die. Its bark can be as thick as two feet, and the tree is very unlikely to fall because the trees in the bunch shield each other from the wind. California has great climates for the redwoods to live in. The place where the redwoods live has an average rainfall of between 60 and 140 inches and an average temperature of 45 to 61 degrees Fahrenheit. All those trees soaking up the sun and then falling and decomposing makes the soil great and rich with minerals. The bark of the trees is also fire resistant, but it can be burnt by lightning flashes. The sequoia tree also has relatives in China. They are called metasequoia glyptostroboids. Metasequoias were thought extinct until 1994 when scientists discovered a small group of trees in the Hubei region of China. The trees were only recognized as metasequoias two years after their discovery due to World War II. They were originally native to China specifically, but botanists brought seeds over to America. There is now a preserve in North Dakota called the Don Redwoods Preservation that is home to many hundreds of acres of metasequoias. Now, the metasequoia is nowhere as tall as the sequoia, since the sequoia is more than 300 feet tall, and the metasequoia can only be as tall as 250 feet. What would a good documentary be without fun facts? A documentary. Here are some fun facts. The tallest ever recorded redwood tree was 378.1 feet and was named Tall Tree. It was not the widest, however. Since the bark of redwood trees is fire-resistant, redwoods cannot burn down to create space for new ones, and that is why they don't reproduce as much. The Native Americans could see for miles to the horizon when they climbed sequoia trees. The wood of sequoia trees is very expensive because it is very sturdy. Sequoias grow on average for 500 to 700 years, but the oldest sequoia tree ever recorded was 2,000 years old. The redwood trees are very interesting, but now this documentary is over. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more cool videos about science and stuff.